Now it's time for a Hollywood classic. This week's Hollywood classic is Curse of the Cat People, Val Luton's sequel to his landmark horror film, eh, Cat People. I love Cat People. Cat People is one of my favorite horror movies. It's a movie that, as time goes on, seems like it's getting more and more traction. You know, more and more people are finding out about it. Even though it was once a slightly obscure horror picture, this one follows up on it. If you'll recall, I believe I've talked about it on the show before, Cat People follows uh, French actress Simone Simon's character, uh, a woman from Eastern Europe who has moved to New York and is afraid of her own sexuality as, as personified in the movie by that if she kisses a guy, she's worried that she's going to turn into a panther for whatever reason. Well, by the end of that movie, poor Simone Simon has passed away. And Curse of the Cat People picks up some years later as Simone Simon's, you know, ex-fiance has married his other girlfriend from the first movie and they have had a daughter. And now that daughter starts to see, uh, starts to see Simone Simon's ghost in the backyard and starts following her around. The movie, it, it's an interesting idea for a sequel because it, it in many ways is only tangentially related to the first movie. There are no threats of cat transformation here, uh, but the movie seems to be dealing more with emotional baggage. Uh, the story is very much the little girl's story. Um, and which is also sort of an odd choice because she certainly could not have known uh, this cat lady or anything. So that's sort of an odd element. I don't know, it, it's an odd movie. It has elements of a thriller, but ultimately I don't think is that exciting. It is well executed and sort of interesting, but I think for me it's more of a curiosity than a home run like Cat People. Still, Interesting and watchable, Curse of the Cat People, three stars. And don't forget to visit our website, northmetrotv.com slash everymovieever. There, you can watch reviews of every movie we've ever covered here on the show, as well as complete episodes. That's NorthMetroTV.com slash every movie ever.